Hello everyone, I'm Kelsey Lemon, Senior Technical Marketing Manager for the Cloud Management Business Unit here at VMware, and I want to welcome you to a special subset of our Day 2 Mastery Series, where I'm going to demonstrate how VMware Skyline and VRealize Operations Cloud can be integrated to help you unify your management and support tasks more effectively. So today, I'm going to discuss how you can get even more value out of Skyline's integration with VRealize Operations Cloud by showing how you can create your own custom alerts and more importantly, show how you can add recommendations that can automate the remediation. As you know, both Skyline and VRealize Operations Cloud help you monitor and troubleshoot potential issues related to the health of the environments that you manage. And a big part of that management process uses findings and alerts, respectively for Skyline and VRealize Operations Cloud. And in a previous workflow session, I showed how Skyline's management pack for VRealize Operations Cloud brings in specific findings as alerts, which help streamline the alert process. But as you know, if you've spent any time at all with monitoring systems, you know that alert fatigue is real. So we're going to try to alleviate some of that fatigue by showing how you can do a couple things. Automate the remediation of Skyline specific findings as alerts in VRealize Operations Cloud. We're going to show you how you can customize alerts to minimize that fatigue and that number. And finally, we're going to show you how you can send notifications to the larger team when they do appear. Now on to the demo. Before I get into creating the alert and applying automation to it, I'm going to enable the VRealize Orchestrator Management Pack. And if you've already installed the Management Pack for Skyline, it's a very similar process. While in VRealize Operations Cloud, go to the Administration tab and you can find it in the repository. Now, I'm enabling this Management Pack because it comes with quite a few of the actions that I'll be able to leverage, such as manage snapshots, decommission a host, and apply host security configuration rules which will play an important role in this particular workflow here. Okay, so now that the pack has been enabled, let's go into Skyline. Now again, in a previous day two workflow session, I showed how you can use scripting and CLI tools to automate Skyline findings and remediation specific to NTP issues. Now I'm going to show how that same finding can be remediated with VRealize Operations Cloud when the orchestrator management pack is enabled. So I'm going to do a keyword search, and there's my finding. And when I click on one of the affected objects, I'm taken to VRealize Operations Cloud, where the Skyline finding appears as an alert, thanks to the fact that the Skyline Management Pack is enabled. As you can see, VRealize Operations Cloud has two recommendations for this Skyline finding, but nothing that automates remediation. But that's OK. I can easily open my vSphere client and manually solve the issue. But I'm happy to say, there's another way. I can create a custom alert that focuses on this issue, complete with unique symptoms to minimize that alert fatigue that I was talking about, and even have it apply an action to that recommendation that actually will resolve the alert. So let's do that. I'll go directly to the alert definition and clone it. I'll give it a unique name. I can also specify wait and cancel cycles if I want to adjust the sensitivity of the alert. Um, increasing these numbers means that the alert will not be triggered until the condition has been seen X amount of successive times, and it will not cancel until that same alert is no longer seen for X amount of successive times. I can even add additional predefined symptoms related to NTP by taking advantage of the VRealize Operations Cloud intuitive drag and drop interface. I can do the same for recommendations as well. But in this case, I'm going to create a custom recommendation that automates remediation. I'll give it a description and leverage orchestrator to apply a predefined action. Apply host security configuration rules. I can even specify policies associated with this alert. As you know, policies are important to effective alert management. It helps reduce alert noise by limiting alert triggers to objects that need them, such as risk alerts for production centers. So as part of the alert creation process, I can manage which policies appear to the alert definition as I create it, rather than by going into the policy afterwards. 
Now for the super cool part. I can send alert notifications to the ServiceNow ticketing system to create incidents via the ServiceNow plugin. And finally, while it's been possible to post alerts to Slack via REST notifications, Virilize Operations Cloud now natively supports it with its own Slack notifications plugin, giving you an end-to-end -end process for all of your IT service management needs. Now let's go back to the alert definition that I created. Instead of two recommendations, it now has three, and one of them is actionable within Virilize Operations Cloud. And that completes the demo. And I want to remind everyone that all Skyline customers are eligible for a free 30-day trial of Virilize Operations Cloud. And if you want to test these workflows yourself, log into Skyline and click that Sign Up button within the Operational Overview card that appears on the Skyline dashboard.